The new vaccine advisory panel handpicked by Health Secretary Robert F. Kennedy Jr. met for the first time yesterday. CBS News medical contributor Dr. Celine Gounder is here to break down uh, what happened there. She's editor-at-large for public health at KFF Health News. Dr. Gounder, thank you very much for being here. So big decision came out of this meeting, a recommendation against, against flu shots that have a particular preservative. What's that ingredient? Is it dangerous? So the ingredient we're talking about is thimerosal. So this is a, a preservative that has frankly not been used in childhood vaccines since the early 2000s. It's only used in 5% of all flu vaccines, uh, flu, for flu vaccines that are multi-dose uh, vials. Uh, and so um, the, I think the key message here is that even if your vaccine has thimerosal, which is very few of them, it's made of ethyl mercury, which is not a form of mercury that builds up in your body. The form that builds up in fish and that can be dangerous in the body is methyl mercury. And that's not what we're talking about here. So this is really more of a symbolic decision than anything else. How big of an impact could it have on people taking the flu vaccine? Well, I think that's really the question, is what kinds of uh, misinformation, myths, does this help uh, uh, reinforce about the safety of vaccines? And unfortunately, this is a new committee, um, newly stocked committee with people who have a history of being against vaccines, vaccine skeptics, people who have been known to promote myths about vaccines. And I think that's, that's really what most of us are concerned about, is that we will see a decrease in vaccine uptake because people are worried.